Hey, 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 it's Rosemary here. How are you doing? Okay, every day you have one less day to realize a vision in your heart. Are you doing everything you can to live it out? Every day you feel less sure that you can change the trajectory of your life. Every day you get more and more stuck in your ways. Every day you give up a little more. So turn that around, honey. Turn it around. You do have passions and you do have a purpose and a reason that you're here. And it is found in the things that you like to do. It is found in the things you think you cannot make any money from. What you do in your spare time, thinking that you just cannot do that as a business or some form of profitable enterprise. What do you think is simply impossible for someone like you to monetize? What if I could prove to you that there is a way to monetize it? What if I could prove to you that you could be responsible for all your current responsibilities and still live out the call on your life? But why should I even have to prove it to you? It is your life after all. Why on earth do you think that you'd be given a gift, a vision, if you're not also supposed to figure out how to make it work for you? What kind of a higher power would taunt you with a dream that you couldn't have? Why do you believe that nonsense? So many questions I know. Think about it though. <laughs> if you believe you have a vision that can change lives, make a difference on the planet, why do you think that you'll also not be provided with a way to prosper in it? The problem is simply that you separate it from money because there is a part of you that still thinks money is bad and only to be earned doing things that are equally bad. Honey, money is lifeless. It is a tool for you to use any old how you want to. But if you keep allowing this nonsensical way of looking at the world to continue, you will not flourish. You'll trap yourself but with your own thinking. So why not open your mind to possibilities? I know you've fought hard and long to get to this particular place of comfort, but honey, you know there is more for you. Okay? You know that story of yours is what it is one that could help other people. You know you have skills that could help more people. You know you're destined for greatness. Will you wake up though? You don't like being told what to do and when to do it, so why not find your own way? I get it, you have bills to pay, and I'm not saying drop everything in order to begin again, unless of course you don't have any responsibilities like children or partner or parents, <laughs> basically. Most of us do though, so you have to be committed enough to create space for exploring possibilities right in the middle of your current existence, because there is a way to monetize your purpose, but you have to be open to look for it. The basics of business are pretty dang simple. Have a product, which can be a service, a book, music, art, other people's products, your, your own invention, whatever it is. Find a willing audience, <laughs> okay? And, and you do that by communicating your heart, your stories, your lessons with them. Capture them into your world by giving them something for free. The, the right ones for you will take it up. Follow up and close some sales. Tell them how you can help them more and ask them to buy. Selling really is a service because you're providing them with something they need. And that is it. Now, in order to keep it this simple, you're going to need to shift some of those internal blocks that make you think that it's complicated and it's impossible. They may be religious blocks or familial blocks or relational blocks or just crazy nonsense of not giving yourself enough, uh, not loving yourself enough to believe in your ability to make a great life. All that stuff needs to be handled because without your head being in the right place, it is nigh on impossible to do what it takes to get the results you want to get. And so, yeah, I can ramble on here forever, but I need you to know this. You can monetize your purpose. You simply have to be willing to play full out and go after something that may currently feel alien to you. Will you do that? Honey, I can help you. And all you need to do right now is if you're serious about moving forward, then let's have a talk. Go over to rosemaryonignite.com forward slash freedom session and go and apply for a conversation with me. It's time to fight for and to deliberately design the life you're born to live because you absolutely want to. Until the next time, bye.